Ivan Lo Lorraine Albright, born in 1897, was an American painter, sculptor, and printmaker. He gained recognition for his self-portraits, character studies, and still lives. His unique technique and dark subject matter often place him among the magic realists and earned him the title of the Master of the Macabre. Coming from a family of artists and artisans, Albright emerged in the 1930s as one of the most mysterious figures in American realism. His emphasis on the fragility of the body, flesh, and the human condition shocked and intrigued viewers. Notable works such as, The Lineman, That Which I Should Have Done I Did Not Do, and The Picture of Dorian Gray showcased his meticulous attention to detail and texture, often requiring years or even decades to complete. While Albright's works can be found in museums across the United States, the Art Institute of Chicago serves as the primary repository for his art. Before the birth of Ivan Lo Lorraine and his identical twin brother Malvin Mar Albright, the Albright family was already known for artwork and craftsmanship. Ivan's father, Adam Emery Albright, was an impressionist painter and his paternal great-great-grandfather was a master gunsmith in Germany. Ivan and Malvin were born in 1897 near Chicago and grew up surrounded by art. Their father used them as models in his paintings and taught them to draw from a young age. They were exposed to prominent American Impressionists and realists through their father's connections. These early experiences played a significant role in shaping Ivan's future as a painter. Ivan's education and career prospects were not straightforward. His family moved frequently, and he attended several different schools. In 1915, he entered Northwestern University but failed to complete his studies. He later enrolled at the University of Illinois at Urbana, contemplating careers in architecture or chemical engineering. However, it was a painting trip to Caracas, Venezuela in 1918 that sparked his serious interest in art. That same year, Ivan exhibited his first work, a watercolor study, at the Art Institute of Chicago. This marked the beginning of his artistic journey. Throughout his career, Ivan Albright continued to create art, despite facing personal and professional challenges. He explored various themes and subjects, often focusing on the darker aspects of life. His attention to detail and meticulous technique became his trademark. In 1945, he gained recognition for his painting, The Temptation of St. Anthony. Despite the ups and downs of his career, Albright's talent was acknowledged, and he received numerous awards and honors. He passed away in 1983, leaving behind a legacy as a unique and influential painter. In conclusion, Ivan Lo Lorraine Albright was a remarkable American painter who left a lasting impression on the art world. Known as the Master of the Macabre, Albright's unique technique and dark subject matter set him apart and placed him among the magic realists. His emphasis on the fragility of the human body and the human condition intrigued and shocked viewers. With meticulous attention to detail and texture, Albright's notable works such as, The Lineman, That Which I Should Have Done I Did Not Do, and The Picture of Dorian Gray, showcased his extraordinary talent. Despite facing personal and professional challenges, Albright continued to create art until his passing in 1983, leaving behind a legacy as a unique and influential painter.